Okay, once you've hooked up your MIDI interface to your piano and your um, computer, next thing you want to do is make sure the, the Mac actually recognizes it. How you're going to do this is you're going to go down to your dock and you're going to locate a program called Audio MIDI Setup. It should be in the dock. Click on it and launch it. Um, and it will load your MIDI setup. Now, notice that my Fastlane USB appears in the window. And the thing you want to know about this, if it's grayed out, it means it's not active. Sometimes if you unplug and plug these things back in, they may um, gray out. And so you're going to have to look for the one that's active and you may have to reconnect it in this case. Um, I'm going to end. So now we've located and we've see our MIDI interface. I'm going to make sure I'm going to add a device here, in this case just a piano. So there's my new external device. You can configure it if you want. I'm just going to call this piano. There should, this should already be appearing in your uh, um, computer screen. If not, you can create one. And you just want to make sure to play it safe that it transmits and receives on all 16 channels. So just make sure these are all highlighted. Now, the next thing I want to do is I want to physically connect, or and they're already physically connected, but I want to tell the computer that it's connected. So in this case, I'm going to go from MIDI out to my piano, and if I click and hold on this, this will actually create a cable to MIDI in on my Fastlane USB. And that's all I need to do. Now, if for some reason um, this is not connected, or say it's connected to a grayed out um, port, right here like this and it's grayed out and there's your new one the only it's very easy to disconnect it all you have to do is just click on the cable so it's highlighted hit the delete button on your keyboard and then reconnect it to the um, interface that's, that's actually not grayed out and this is telling the Mac now that okay this is my MIDI setup this is what it looks like and that's all you have to do to get your setup to work